realize that for an average man, it must seem as if you have all the time in the world. I, however, am on a very, very tight schedule nowadays. So let's get a move on, shall we? Please, sit down. So, Mr. Polly Clements, may I call you Paul? I've been expecting you for quite some time now. What has it been? Three, four, five years since we last spoke? Time is fleeting, I know, but I get the sense that you've been avoiding me. Oh, no. No, not at all, sir. I would never think of trying to do that, sir. It's just that... That you never thought you'd see me again. That you escaped the bonds of our secret alliance. Why, I've known you for perhaps all your life. And after a lifetime of favors and sacrifices I've chosen to bestow upon you, have you chosen the path of betrayal against me? Surely you don't believe it fair to leave your debts unpaid? No, of course not. Very well, then. I'm glad we understand one another. Now down to business. How do you plan to pay off your loan? It's a bank statement, sir, of everything I own. My car, my house, my savings. Please, please, take, take everything that you desire. All of it, if you must. Well, 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 you haven't failed me as miserably as I thought you would. I wasn't convinced you could handle yourself after I granted you those initial loans. But you worked your life away in that godforsaken factory, didn't you? In a vain attempt to support that unfortunate family of yours. Yeah, I guess. So does this make us even now? <laughs> of course not, Paul, my boy. You mustn't forget the interest rate, inflation, and certainly a late payment fee. I'm afraid your possessions alone will never be enough to cover your debt completely. However, there are exceptions. Are you worthy? What will you provide to testify that you are worthy of my forgiveness? Please, sir, look at this. It's a list of all the good things I've done. Why, yes, yes indeed. There's no questioning the merit in your achievements. Volunteered at your local hospital. Raised two children, who at least are still alive. Why you even pay your taxes? But while this all looks fine and dandy, how can you justify? All the money that your hand is taking from your job each year. All the lies that your mouth has uttered attempting to get ahead in life. And all the dirty little thoughts that your mind has conceived and concealed. Including that one secret you kept from your wife for so long. How do you know all these things? I'm a businessman. I watch my assets very carefully. I've been watching your every move since the day you came to me. <laughs> so what are you gonna do? Kill me now? Now let me make this perfectly clear to you. I am not a man of revenge. I most definitely never one of violence. Personally. To think I would stoop so low as to waste a soul as enticing as your own. It's just that I desire. No. Nope. Deserve payment. Compensation for all I provided you with over the years. After all, Paul, life in the end is just one big transaction. I didn't make the rules. So let me ask you one more time. What can you offer me to justify all that I have given you? Look me in the eyes when I'm talking to you. You've yet to mention one crucial sacrifice, Paul. If you won't give it to me, I'll be forced to take it from you. It's hopeless. If you really believe that anything could set you free, what could possibly save you now? Here's my payment, in full. Get out. Get out of here, you completely wasted my time. Damn it, lost another one. Mr. Devin Falson, may I call you Dev? I've been expecting you for quite some time now. I know. And I have your payment in full. 
I hope that you find it to your satisfaction. I see. May I be sure that this is all you have to offer me? It is indeed. I'm a businessman, just as you are, so I certainly understand the importance of equalizing transactions. Simply splendid. Everything seems to be in order, then. If you will follow me, I will immediately show you to your new accommodations. So, Devin, my boy, I was going through your file, and it seems to me, with a brain so full of knowledge, you will be of great use to my organization for a long time to come. Perhaps forever. Ha 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 ha.